hit the ground. What's good? Is you? Who you think it is? The boys ain't done pumped you up in the head. If you wasn't my brother, we got hit in the mouth for that. Get in. There's plenty of room. What's up, T? What's up, T? Don't let that chew out, B. About five hours. So I know you're ready to get it on the five. Yeah, let's get it. <laughs> so, Alex, uh, Mr. Fitzgerald could make it today. What? Yeah, I know, but he's going to represent it. Yeah. I'm going to talk to him over represent. Nah, see, you want to see this one. Because this one, you can get us a capital we need from Fitzgerald. And uh, <laughs> she might be a little easy to talk to. She? Mr. Jackson? Yes, ma'am. Yolanda Young. Hope that's my way of receiving. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How's she? I gotta admit, I was expecting Mr. Fitzgerald. Mr. Jackson, I am Mr. Fitzgerald. Well, of course, what I mean is, I handle all of Mr. Fitzgerald's business affairs. When you talk to me, you're talking to Mr. Fitzgerald. Oh, really? Mr. Jackson, do you have a problem doing business with a woman? Or is it just the color of my skin? Yeah, for a Business before pleasure, Mr. Jackson. Mrs. Young. Miss. Miss Young. I can assure you, I have no problem doing business with a beautiful black woman. And trust me, the color of your skin has nothing to do with the color of mine. Well, shall we get down to business then? Absolutely. So as you probably already know, so this global entertainment is responsible for funding several major labels, as well as many other individual projects. And if you've done your homework, you also know that this global entertainment has a 100% success rate in everything we put our money into. In other words, everything we touch simply turns to gold. Now, Mr. Jackson, I don't know what type of deal you're looking for, so Swiss Global Entertainment is into ownership. Ownership produces a residual income, which is the source of success of Swiss Global Entertainment. Now, what we're prepared to offer you is $7.5 million in exchange for 65% ownership of Dale South Records. Just like that. $7.5 million. Why? I mean, that's a lot of money, Michelle. We believe in you. We believe in your work. We believe in your talent. You would continue business as usual. You would have complete control of how you do I do something you don't like, right? Michelle, 7.5 million is a lot of money. But so is 65% ownership of my company. So you tell Mr. Fitzgerald. I am Mr. Fitzgerald. And I'm telling you, I'm not giving up control and vote of my company. So, if you, him, or whoever wants to buy 45% ownership of my company, then we can talk. 
Mr. Jackson, are you turning down our offer? No. Compounding the offer. Mr. Jackson, you do realize that there's a long line of talent just waiting for the opportunity that's being presented to you? And I'm sure there is. But let's be honest. You're not sitting in front of them right now. Miss Young, I'm just a country boy. Grew up on fat back. Collard greens, sweet potatoes, and watermelon. But make no mistake about it. I know exactly what we have here. We have a continual fan base, which leads to residual income, which is the success of your company, according to you. And trust me, you haven't seen our best work yet. Hey, I'm going to roll with Mike. Um, oh, my bad. No, nah, it's all right. Come on here. Miss Young, this is Maurice, a.k.a. Teach. Hi, Miss Young. Nice to meet a beautiful black woman. Nice to meet you, too, Mr. Maurice Jackson. Hey, yo, I'm about to roll with Mike. I'm going to catch up with you later. All right, man. You good? Yeah, I'll show you. Behave. All right. So I'm assuming Maurice is your brother. Just knowing that you should start smelling dollar signs. But is he talented? You taught me. Mr. Jackson, thank you for your time. You've given me a lot to consider. So how about that drink? I'll be in touch in three days. Let me get that door open. Hey, yo, Mike, I gotta get it. No matter if it's Mike's or Dice, I'm trying to stack paper more thicker than Will Smith's wife. <laughs> you better get it if you can, man, after the night. Down South Records gonna triple in price. Yeah. Believe me that it's real. Cause when I'm getting meals, custom cars in the garage with my emblem on the grill. <laughs> and two, I'm getting bills for bills. So these women want to push up on me like crash dummies to win shields. Yeah, I really is. don't know my fate, but if I drop on New Year's, and these women gonna sex on spring break. So <laughs> bling, bling. <Yeah. laughs> yes, yo, yo, that was hot, dude. Listen, you got to lay that down. Yo, I'm gonna lay that down, man. I got plenty of more, too. Man, if it's any like what I just heard, then you gonna be in some job off. What? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm gonna blast past that little dude. Man, all I know is Fitz Global looking at us, he doing his thing. You home? Man, we gonna all get paid. Yeah, I know we are, man. Hey, yo, mm. fire that up. Nah, man. What? And you better not let Alex know you like that up neither. What? I'm saying. Your brother's wearing a tight shit, man, man. No drugs, period. Yo, whatever. I'm a grown man. He the one got me started. I'm just saying, dude. Do not go up in there high. Man, whatever. Hey, what we rolling to? Yo, D, you wanna link up? D? Man, I ain't rolling with D. I'm not rolling with D. You already hating? 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 Man, I'm just not rolling with D. That's what I'm saying. Go scoop D. Pick up some honeys, make some moves. Man, I already got you set up. Yo, why'd you say that in the first place? Females. Yo, they better look good and have some teeth. I know your type of woman. <laughs> man, whatever, yo. Whatever. <laughs> Baby, this is our home. Yeah. I never dreamed we would live in a place like this. I remember how much we struggled, having no money, no clothes for the kids, barely paying the utility bills. Remember that one bedroom apartment? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Now to this. Yeah. I know I haven't always believed in you. I didn't believe in your dreams. I just watched you work so hard and 
you struggle. Baby, I don't deserve this. Come on, baby, just have a drink. You know, don't, don't do that. I don't. I don't deserve any of this. But I'm so grateful. I'm grateful to God. I'm grateful for you. I'm just so grateful. You know, you are a good man. The kind of man I want our girls to marry. Oh. <laughs> I'm being serious. And you can be cool about yours, but. You had seen the numbers that came across my desk today. You would be too. In 30 days, it still goes through. Never have to worry about money again. Well, Mr. Producer, one celebration at a time. Let's get this party started. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. How can I help you? Okay, how can you help me? Okay. 45%, that sounds better. What's your offer? Make it five as a deal. Okay. So when can we expect the paperwork? Now? No, 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 that's not a problem. Yeah, I know where it is. Okay, um less than an hour I'll be there. Okay, sounds good. Hey, baby, wake up. Hey, baby. Hey, wake up. Wake up. What? It happened, baby. Look at me. It happened. What happened? It happened. Come on, I ain't dressed. Get up. Come on. Baby. Yes, baby. baby. It happened. Right. Come on. Get up. It happened. Get up. Five million dollars. Five. Five million dollars? What? I told you. Come on, help me get dressed. Okay. Baby, hurry up. But well, baby, it's two o'clock in the morning. Oh, I mean, yeah, I gotta go though. Oh, get my socks. Hurry up, please. Don't hurry. So, I mean, teacher Mikey, they're going with you, right? No, I don't have time to wait for him. But I do need you to call Tom and tell him to meet me. Meet you where, baby? Fix Global. Come on, baby. Wake up. Five million dollars. Come on. Mom. Hey, baby. Come here, baby. Get in the bed. Okay. I gotta go. All right. Come on. Come on. What happened? Baby, I'll just tell you about it in a minute. I just got some good news. Oh, baby, I can't believe this is really happening. Oh, boy. Baby, here's your sweater. Oh, take my hat down. <laughs> believe me. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
I love you. <laughs> Do you know what time it is? Didn't I tell you 12 o'clock? This way. I'm going to deal with you when I get home. Well, somebody noticed me. Say what? Look, look, baby. Look, you got to go. Look, I'll handle you, this. You better deal with yeah, that. I'll I'm serious. It. I got it. All right. All right. Five minutes. Yeah. Five minutes. All right. God take you. This is my attorney, Tom Wilson. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Snow. Mr. Wilson, this is Janet Phillips. Thank you. General. Nice to meet you. Please, have a seat. Gentlemen, it's getting late, so I'm going to go ahead and get down to business. This is a contract per Miss Young and Mr. Jackson's agreement. I'm sure you find everything to be in order. It says here you'll be relocating the offices at Down South Records. Per Mr. Jackson's approval, of course. So are we talking about a new studio? No, just the office. The studio will remain in its current location. And I assume this will be at the expense of its global? What is the expense of its global? How will the funds be handled? The funds will be transferred to an account of your choosing within three business days, Mr. Jackson. That looks good to me. Thank you. You're welcome. Chain him and take care of him. I will deal with you later. Y'all carry on. Go away from here. I am familiar with Mr. Lynch's methods. We'll be in trouble in a few years on my farm if we don't start producing some babies over there. That brings me to my proposition. And what might that be? Levi. Hey. How'd it go? What's the deal? How'd it go? It was good. <laughs> well, did you sign it? Get up. 
So fresh, so clean, so clean when I pull up on the scene. Got new nights, new ice, new bling. It seems I got new everything. It's amazing how the green make women see me like a king. They telling me I am they dream. Every woman's magazine material that's on my arm. Swag is me, on my charm. It don't matter cause I bag them, just stab them and send them on. And they gone and I'm gone to make big moves. I'm so smooth, you so. Nigga, I me to coach you. Get your clothes right, shoes tight. Get a fine girl from out of town. Show her around, then dump her for her best friend. And if you're not, oh well, study me in detail. A nigga like me is so fly. Take off like I work for Chippendale. Airport, no luggage. Shot when I hit the city. All my women, not so ditty. They so pretty, my committee. I run them like I was Diddy. I'm so fresh and I'm so witty. I don't have to chase no money. Cause the money come and get me, get me, get me. And fly from my head to my toes From my head down to my toes Everybody know that I be fresh And fly from my head to my toes From my head down to my toes Everybody know that I be fresh And fly, fresh And fly from my head down to my toes Everybody know that I be fresh And fly, fresh And fly from my head down to my toes Everybody know that I be fresh Oh, man, you know what? I'm telling you, that shit was hot, man. I'm telling you, teach might be knocking me down a notch on the charts, bro. Hey, y'all, we done for the night. Good job. Yeah, if he can keep his ass out of trouble. Wrap it up. Yeah, you still got it. You know, I still got it. I'm about to blow up. Now all you gotta do is keep your ass out of trouble. I'm gonna stay out of trouble, man. I got this. I'm serious, man. Look, you helped me get all this shit started. So you ain't got a damn thing to show for it. Now I'm telling you, this is your hour to get paid. But you gotta stay out of trouble, man. Because you grown, you can do whatever you want. But when you come up in here, don't come up in here high and start that shit. So I see you got your boy D making paper for you, so you can do this with or without me. This ain't got nothing to do with D, man. Mm. And that's another thing. You're going to have to squash that noise between you. You know, I'm a grown man. Let me worry about my personal business. Besides, you need to be worrying about downside records, which if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't even have. I taught you. All you had was some money your daddy gave you. Still carrying around. Yeah, my dad was there for me. He was supposed to be there for me. So what? You want me to be mad about that? I can't help your dad and what now. Yo, my dad didn't care nothing about me. Okay, he ain't give a damn about you. But the shit could have been worse, man. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. You tell me how it could have been worse. There goes my dad. You okay? Oh. Oh, so you over it? You over it? Yeah, see? Welcome to my world. Monique, hurry up.
Hey, it's Misha. I need you to take your sister to school for me this morning, okay? I'm gonna be late. Yeah, you're not gonna be late. You gotta pass right by our school. But I have to pick up Melissa. You will not be picking up Melissa. Not after what happened last night. But nothing. So you can take her to school. I can take both of you to school. Exactly. Bye, Mommy. All right, ladies. Y'all have a good day. Good morning, Mr. Jackson. Miss Young. I hope you don't mind me riding along with you to the office. I was about to thank you for the ride. No need to thank me. Mr. Jackson, it's like I said. It's all yours if you want it. But I don't believe in beating around the bush. So let's stop playing these games and get straight down to business. It's all yours if you want it. Hey man, what you doing here by yourself, man? Just having a drink, man. It's Ryan having his housewarming party, man. I ain't even in the mood for it. No. Excuse me, excuse me. I'd like to get a toast. Wait, man, I was gonna make the toast, man. <laughs> what? What, you wanna get the toast? Yeah. Listen, brother, we didn't even know you could talk without rhyming. That's what I'm saying, but I wanna hear this. Let's let him do it. Okay. Mr. Number One is in the building. Who's number one in the charts right now? Hey, yo, Teach, come on. We're toasting up without me? Mr. Number One? You might be number one out there, but ain't here, you're still Maurice. So sit your big country ass down so we can get our toes with. Uh, hey, look, I apologize for being late. You know, just enjoying the company of these two beautiful black women. You know, I don't like y'all color struck Willie Lynch brothers. Who? Willie Lynch. I don't know who Willie Lynch is. Let me educate you brothers, man. Willie Lynch was a slave owner. We taught white slave owners how to control black slaves, separate the light from the dog. You know, he took the men from their wives to go mate with other women to create more slaves. He said our mindset was going to be this for 300 years. That was back in 1712. You do the math. That's why we need to start appreciating our beautiful black women. Thank you so much, Teach, for that lovely piece of education. But when you do find a good woman, please let me know. What you talking about? Big Brook had one. You know, you hold it down right there. They can teach you a little bit more than uh, than just music. <laughs> hey, but look, man, we're gonna toast this thing up for what? You gonna let you gonna let Mr. Number One toast this thing up for what, big bro? Good toast, man. To being number one. <clears throat> so, after all that education, you're finna go get it in with two of them. Hey, man, the truth is the truth. But I do it not. <laughs> so, I got fellas, man.
Daddy, you okay? Yeah, baby. What's up with you? Miss Young and her guests are leaving. Mom says come say goodbye. Me and you, what's up with you? What you been up to? Nothing, really. Yeah. Every time I show somebody a picture of you, they say we look alike. Ew. My friends say that, too. They always say, I can't believe he's not your real dad. And I say he's better than your real dad. He never left us. I'll never leave you, baby. Come here. Come here. <clears throat> love you, baby. I love you, too, Dad. Dad, hmm? I'm sorry for coming in late. Sorry. But now I know you critics know When I'm in the building Find a swimming Walking through the door Management be asking me Where is it I wanna go Wherever, whenever Whoever, whoever Spending dough All money ain't good money Cloudy days I'm in the beach sunny But even on them stormy days I can fly to dry land To get money Then finish college But I'm not a dummy Got what I was needing Then proceeded to start My own business Now I just make more money They laughed at me Said I couldn't do it At the same time They just bummed me They working for another man Making him rich That's real Funny. Turning all believers to believers Every time I spit a line And it's not about my rats It's about my paper Don't waste my time Time is my money Money is my time So every time you see me I am always on my line I want money 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 Get your damn hands off of me. Baby, what's wrong? Get your damn hands off of me. You ain't shit, Alex. You ain't shit. Hey, come on, talk to me. Talk to you. Why don't you talk to your bitch? My bitch? What yes, you your bitch. About? Oh, you, you want to lie in my face? Lying? What yes. Lying? I'm lying. Lying about what? I waited up for you. You know what? I saw the signs. And you know, I thought it was me, but you know what? I believed in you because I was a dumbass. <laughs> no. <laughs> Touch me. Stay the hell away from me. Baby, I'm sorry. You're sorry? What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Did you sleep with her? Did you sleep with her in my bed? Oh, baby, I wouldn't do that. Yeah, you said you also wouldn't cheat on me either. Baby, listen, listen. You know. No, baby, listen to me. It's not you. You got to go. <laughs> you got to get, get the hell out of here. You, you got to go.
<laughs> you gotta go. I just, I can't deal with you right now. But don't get it twisted. You need to be back here tonight. Care what you gotta do, but cut that shit off of that bitch. You figure out what the hell you want. Mr. Fitzgerald? Alex. You okay? You sound a bit surprised. No, I, I was just wondering if I dialed the right number. How are you doing? Good, good. You know, Alex, it's a price to pay for success. A tremendous price. Yeah, well, I, I suppose so. Well, listen, Yolanda, um, she's busy right now. In fact, she probably tied up the rest of the evening. Would you like to leave a message? Well, no, I'll, you know what? Just tell her I'll call her tomorrow. Okay, man, enjoy it. Yeah. Okay. You, um, you have a good evening, too. Make it up. What you do, stay here all night again? <laughs> Come on, man. Get up, Flash. Come see you, man. Teach. Teach. Come on, baby. Get up. Get up. Talk to me. <laughs> Come on, baby, let's go call your daddy. Come on, man. I want my mom. <laughs> I'm so sorry. 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 I'm
Snake boy. You must let the Almighty be your guidance, you know. He'll give you a gift. He'll show you things you don't know. Listen. You must see with your heart. It's a gift. You ungrateful nigger. I paid good money for you, and I expect to get my money's worth. Now you get your ass in there and get to work. We need you right out. That's it, boy. Baby, I know I was supposed to be home last night. Tried to call Yolanda last night. Fitzgerald said she was busy. Hey, hey. You need to call your brother. Mikey's been trying to reach you all night. Pleasure to probably to meet you. I'm sorry to have to be under these circumstances. My week's gonna be great to miss. Listen, Alice, I'm gonna get straight to the point. This global, we're terminating your contract. What? What's this about? Excuse me, ladies. Could you leave Alex now alone? It's about money, Alex. This global win the business is making money. And downside, it's becoming more of a liability than an asset. And now that Maurice is gone, you don't have nothing. What about D? What about D? D feels unappreciated. Ever since Teach came home, I feel like you put him on the back burner. Furthermore, I got him signed to another label. Man, you can't do this. I can and I have. As of 9 o'clock this morning, all the assets have been frozen. All your royalties ceased. You take this up with my attorney, man. Who, Tom? Your turn? I tell you what, when you talk to him, ask him if we still on for this weekend. He's supposed to play golf at the country club Saturday. That's right, Alex. They don't never trust an attorney. Me and Tom, we go way back. In fact, he's been on my payroll for years. 
man, why are you doing this? What what what's what's going on? You why wanted you to play with the big dogs in the attics? Did you think the house, the cars, the limousines, the fancy nights in the hotels, did you think those belonged to you? They belong to me. That ass that you been laying up with, it belongs to me too. Yeah, that's right. She belonged to me. She do what I tell her to do, who I tell her to do it with. But man, you're trying to play me? How does it feel, Alex? How does it feel to have something important you taken away and know it's never coming back? It's gone, Alex. The money, the houses, the car, it's all gone. And how long do you think that pretty little thing, what's her name? Sharon gonna stay with you, especially since somebody gonna send her pictures of your little secret. Man, who the hell you think you are? You don't know? Alex Jackson, son of Albert Washington, who died in 1979, lost his bout to colon cancer. Hmm. I guess some people get what they deserve. Oh, that's right, Alex. Get mad. Get real mad. I've been waiting my entire life for this moment. To see you hurt, to see you feel with hurt and feel with pain. Man, what the hell are you talking about, man? You don't know? You took it from me, Alex. He was mine. What? He was my daddy first. You just had to be born. He left me because of you. He never came to see me again. He never could spend time with me because he was always with you. He never even told you about me, did he, Alex? He never even told you about me. Where you going, Alex? Huh? Where you going, little brother? He ain't tell you about me, huh? Right on time. No, son, he is. Take a ride with me. You're one of the most talented men I've ever met. It takes a wise man to recognize the price of success. I ain't doing too good at it. As of 9 o'clock this morning, I lost everything. So you say you lost it all, huh? What is it that you lost? Everything. House, cars. Money, my wife. It's tough being a man, Alex. Material things can be replaced, but a good woman, you can't replace her. Never underestimate the power of a strong black woman. But she needs her man to be free. Break the chain. You don't have to be here. Break the chain and go home. Henry. 
ain't always going to be this way. I belong here. I belong to Quincy Jackson. I was Henry Jackson now. I ain't never leaving. I miss you. I thought I'd never see you again. You couldn't let go. Missy, I feared you wouldn't be. trying to buy lunch, and they tell me that the card has been canceled. And if that wasn't enough, I go down to the bank, and they tell me that the card, I don't even have access on the account anymore. I mean, damn, Alex, really? Let's go. What? The money. Contracts, residuals, everything. Boom. What do you need? It was a game. Fitzgerald, Yolanda, they set me up. Tom was even in on it. Tom? Fitzgerald wanted to hurt me, so he gave me the fame, the money, the toys. The woman? Yeah. He wanted to hurt me, so he helped me get to the top and took it all away from me. That was his plan. Why? Why you? He was my brother. My father's son. I never knew him. You know what? That doesn't matter. Him, this money, this contract, the house, it doesn't matter. It's you. And the girls. I don't know if I could ever make up for what I've done. I don't even know if you'll let me, but I do know I've been a fool. Acting like a slave and like money and fame and wealth was everything, and it's not. I've lived without all of that. But I can't live without you. You're still standing here. And you don't have to be here. Your strength blows me away, black woman. And I'm going to fight to keep you. You're my queen. Beautiful black queen. I'm so sorry I hurt you.
studio and pack some things up, all right? You hear that shit? That's my brother? Yeah, that's your brother, man. Who else would it be? Yo, this shit about to blow up, man. What do you like this? Turn my clothes to these pants out here. Play it back. Your brother was something else, man. Yo. Listen, Alex, man, I got the whole concept laid out already. Check this. Alive from the dead. Can't do it, man. Listen, Alex, I know this is hard for you. I know you miss your brother. But this is a masterpiece and a tribute to Maurice. Can't do it because we ain't got the money. What? I don't even understand that. Fitzgerald terminated our contract. No more funds. No more money. No more assets. It's all gone, man. It's what? gone. Why? Since we're more of a liability now that teach gone. Okay. What about D? Sold out. Work for Fitzgerald now. Okay, listen. Teach music is still alive. He got to change his mind if he hear this. We got to take it to him. Who not going to want to invest in this? Nah, man. I say we just throw the towel in, man. I'm sick of this. Man, I don't let this game come between me and my family, man. And it ain't worth it. Not to me. You are not a quitter. You are stronger than this, Alex. I told you I was proud of you. And I, I am proud of you. Because you've never quit. So don't start now. If you quit on your dreams, you quit on yourself. And if you quit on yourself, you're quitting on me. You messed up, Alex. So now you need to get up and fix it. And I messed up too. But I'm here to make things right. I haven't always supported you in the past. I didn't stand behind you. You struggled all the way to the top and you made it without me. And now I see you struggling again, baby. But this is my second chance 
stand behind you and to support you like a good woman should. That's why I'm here. I'm dressed. I'm ready to work. I love you too. Everything good in here? Oh, y'all hugging and kissing. What's <laughs> up, so, boy? Ow. Listen, are we going to make this thing pop or what? I got a whole list of people who got money to call. Oh, wait a minute. I was saving this for a rainy day. Woo! <laughs> it's raining now. You know, in life, we made mistakes. Sometimes, the only way to correct them is taking it back. Taking it back to the roots. I'ma take it back to the roots, cause the proof is in the truth. And I don't care what the industry think, it's what I'm gonna do. Video game mentality best describes you. Get up on TV and let the world control you. But me, I'm a little thick, I'm cut from a different cloth. My brother seen his father, my dad I never saw. My mother, she really loved me, but I couldn't get it right. So now, I only see it when I'm sleeping at night. And we claim to be grown, living life so wrong. Still stuck under that Willie Lynch syndrome. About 300 years. Is Mr. Willie being gone, but the way we act, Mr. Lynch is right at home. We living like slaves, let me explain to you. Got a good woman, but you having sex with a few. Get a couple of them pregnant, you a deadbeat too. Now ain't that what slave masters used to get us to do? But take it back to my roots. Will they give me some finish in what you saying in your verse are worth more than your image? I'ma take it back to my roots. Will we unite to fight, and we fight to make sure that you just get in it right. I'ma take it back to my roots. Where your music is based around the truth. Bracing and watch. No college was speaking knowledge while he rap about guap. No wonder I came home and went straight to the top. My brother, he really hated when I bring his name up. But we lions in the den, what you doing with a puff? Let's be honest, your whole flow could fit in a sippy cup. You like a well caucus on the beach. You want